Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Hold on, my TV's on. Let me turn it down. Okay, so I'm lagging with the uploads just because I have this really boring set on right now. This is what I have on my nails right now and I plan on keeping this on until my birthday, which is on the 30th. So I'm gonna keep a short set on, let my nails grow a little bit and then I'm going to do my birthday set. So that's why I haven't really uploaded but I did get some new stuff in and I just wanted to do a really quick unboxing so you guys can see what I got. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So the I got three things, it's really no big deal, but the first two things I'm just gonna show you because the last one's kind of what I'm trying to emphasize, I guess. Um, but the first thing I got was some LED lights, um, but the difference with these is that it's a flashlight. So you guys know that I only do Opre nails and poly gel. So when I purchased the Opre system, um, it comes with like the little lamp. Let me show you this. So it comes with this super tiny lamp, which I mean, obviously it's functional, it works, but because it has a cord, it's just, it's too much. I have so much stuff that I have plugged in when I'm doing a client that I really don't have time to be like unplugging everything. So I needed something a little bit easier and handheld. So I found these LED lights. This isn't like a regular black light. This is advertised for nails specifically. So if you're using the Opre system, I think this would be much easier to cure a finger rather than having the whole cord and the awkwardness of a full lamp so I love this um, I'll link it down below I also got this on Amazon so these were eight dollars but the cool thing is they come with three of them so you get the pink one and then there's a green and a blue one so you get three for eight dollars that's really not that bad sorry my fire alarm has a little battery but yeah so that's that the next thing I got is something that I needed because I have all these poly gels but I don't have a clear poly gel and I wanted a crystal clear poly gel. I heard that um, McCart has a really really good one but I decided to go with model ones just because that's where I get a lot of my nail products just because um, I don't know it's just been a reliable brand for me. I love model ones so this is the clear poly gel I got. I thought it would be a little bit bigger than this, but it's not bad. So this is what it looks like. Um, and yeah, let's open it up and see. So I'm just gonna zoom in so you guys can see what I'm about to do. Okay, this is what it looks like. Really, alarm? Okay, so this is what it looks like. I'm just gonna pull this off and just squeeze some of it out so you guys can see what color it is. So obviously it doesn't look clear in the bottle. I mean, it kind of does, but I'm hoping this works well. Now can I get it to go back in? There it goes. So that's that. Clear poly gel. Um, when I do my birthday set, I'm most likely going to be doing poly gel because it's been a long time since I've used poly gel. This, is, uh, this set right here is a prey. Um, in the last video you guys saw the Halloween nails that I did so I really just all I did was cut them down and rebalance them And I'm just gonna let them grow a little bit. So the last thing that I got is a new nail drill Reason being is because the nail drill that I was using in my previous videos Was actually not that bad of a drill considering it was only like $25 or something like that. It was really cheap and I think it's perfect for beginners, like when you're just starting out and stuff. It's a really good drill. It's not bulky. It's nice and small. The um, the thing that controls the speed is nice and compact, so it's just like not a headache. But if you guys are familiar with that drill, if you guys have ever seen it, um, it's extremely hard to take the bits out and put the bits in. Um, and I threw it, I'm so stupid, I threw it away. I did, right? Yeah, I threw it away. I wanted to show you guys um, what the issue with it was, but I threw it away and now I can't show you guys. But I'm gonna link it down below. I'm actually gonna put a picture of it right here. 
just in case you're looking for a drill um i no longer recommend that one um just because it was a nightmare like it became a nightmare it works really well but the issue is um putting the bits in and taking them out i literally had to use pliers every time i did somebody's set when i was switching out the drill bits so it was just terrible but like I said, as far as how it functions, it works really well if you're looking for a drill on a budget, but the bits is just an issue. And um, so most of the more like high-end drill bits, you're able to screw the bottom of the, um, the drill so you can take the bits out really easy. But that one, no option for that. It just, it's... Okay, so I got a new one. Looks like this. I will link it down below. This one is from uh, McCart also, and I think it was like 55 or something. So, I don't know. I kind of wish that I just invested it in a more expensive one so that I didn't have to go through two of them because now I've spent a total of 80 when I could have just, you know, got a quality one from the start. Um, this one's nice because it comes in a case. And I needed a case because ugh, it's just, I'm just a mess. So let's open it. This is my first impression of this also. I've only seen pictures on Amazon. Ooh. So this is what the inside looks like. Um, you have this little pocket here and it comes with the user manual. So let's go ahead and get into what is in here. I feel like I keep going out of focus. Am I? Okay, the first thing it comes with are, this is like standard in every drill bit that you purchase. Um, I already have one of these. And yeah, that's that. I don't really like those just because I don't feel like they're quality. I don't know, I just never, when I use them, they don't really file anything. They don't do anything for me, so yeah. Okay, what else does it come with? It comes with the cord to charge. It comes with this little stand, which is nice. Uh, this is like silicone. Nice little stand. And then, I don't know what this is, but we're gonna find out in a second. Okay, so here is the actual drill. I'm so excited, it looks so good. Okay, so I'm gonna take this off. What does this do? I don't know, like it goes on top here, but I don't know what it's for. I need to figure it out. So, this is what I'm talking about. With the old drill that I had, this does not screw. So this is basically to lock the bit in place. On the other drill that I had, it didn't have that. It was just like you literally had to push it in and then pull it out. So this is so much better because it's gonna secure the bit and not damage the drill. So that's nice. So as you guys can see, it has the lock and unlock and then from there you can pull the drill out put it in lock it up and it's nice and secure so that's really nice it comes with a long cord which is also tractable which I like and then obviously the cord and this part goes into the motor is that what we're gonna call this I don't know uh, but this is basically um how you control the speed and all that stuff this is pretty hefty this is a big boy so on the side here it has forward and reverse speeds and then you just plug it in up here at the top and then then the power is up here so you just turn oh it's cordless y'all i didn't even know that it's cordless look i saw that because it's not even plugged in this is where you charge it remember i showed you guys the charger i feel so like stupid right now <laughs> with this review but anyway um it charges and when you turn it on you see it turns on oh it's spinning so let me show you guys how lot oh that goes fast that scares me Okay, so we're gonna switch it on and let you guys listen. Zero speed, and then you turn it. Low. 
medium. And then reverse. That high speed sounds extremely dangerous. That's gonna burn a hole in your freaking bones, dude. So that is the drill, I'm very excited. So actually today I'm not gonna be able to do a preview on this, just because like I said, I'm keeping this set on for a while. I was gonna do a pedicure with this drill, but um, I'm actually not gonna do that. Cause I don't like using drills on my toenails because those are my real nails um so you guys have to wait um i'll probably upload another video maybe like in two weeks or something um doing my birthday nails and i'll show you guys how this drill works i'm so excited especially because i find out it's cordless because i told you guys i have so many cords from my lamp to my light to my little lights to my desk light to my vacuum thing i have so many cords so this is so much more convenient and it has this little this little hook right here you could just put it on your pants do what you gotta do and you're good i'm obsessed and it has amazing reviews so like i said i'm gonna link it down below so you guys can see that so yeah but yeah i'll see you guys in the next video thanks again so much for watching and don't forget to hit subscribe and like and comment and stuff like that especially if you are an experienced tech or if you're a new tech i want to know everything because I'm new. So if you guys have any advice for me, suggestions, whatever, leave them down below. And yes, yeah, so I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.